I had never seen more desperation in this nation than I'm seeing it today. I really believe that Americans are coming to a point, especially the evangelical communities coming to a point, to realize we can't fix ourselves. And without God stepping in, I mean, this could really go off the cliff way beyond anything that one day, five years from now, 10, ten years from now, where we would even be able to recognize it. You think about what's happened in a period of time in just six weeks, the whole redefinition of marriage, the entire issues with the Planned Parenthood videos, then the entire issue in relationship to the Iran crisis, and, and it goes on and on and on. And in relationship to that, to think about that, I mean, tell me, is there a politician that can get us out of it? Is there new legislation that can get us past it? I mean, is there a decision or an ideology that can be created that can change the course of where we are? While all those matters are important and we need to be involved in them and we need to be vigilant in the fight, I declare that there is only one hope and it's the gospel of Jesus Christ and it's the church being revived and the next great awakening coming to the United States. And that's what I'm trusting God for. I am too. That is our hope. It's the great hope. It's the only hope. Absolutely.